A new study by the CDC estimates more than one in five American adults may experience COVID effects for weeks to months after they test positive for the virus. KITV Forest Kristen Concilio now joins us live after speaking with a woman suffering from long haul symptoms for the past two years. Kristen. Rick, Mika, with many people now becoming infected with COVID, there are new worries about those with long lasting health problems. Long haul symptoms can be minor or severe and last weeks or longer. According to the CDC, symptoms can include difficulty breathing, fatigue, heart palpitations, brain fog, and mood swings. Former news reporter Angela Keene knows firsthand how painful long COVID can be. But I know there's so many people that are just beginning the long COVID journey. It's a long one and it's a miserable one. And so many people end up out of work. So it's it's a big concern. There's going to be this population of people who are very, very sick and um, doctors don't know how to fix them. Keen contracted the virus in March 2020, oh about 60 to 90 days after her bout with COVID. She developed unusual symptoms, including brain fog, night sweats and emotional issues. She says the entire front, frontal lobe of her brain was inactive because of the disease. State health officials don't know how many are suffering from long haul COVID in the islands and say it'll take some time for local researchers to study the issue. Reporting live, Kristen Concilio, KITV4 Island News.